Well, welcome back. Well, how do you achieve the best lake living life? Brian Boer, real estate agent at Berkshire Hathaway Home Services Premier Properties, is here with some suggestions to ensure you can fully enjoy that beautiful lake property. Brian, welcome back to the show. Great to have you with us. So what's the number one thing you think is important to make sure we can fully enjoy that beautiful lake property? Yeah, absolutely. So the number one thing to make sure that you fully enjoy your lake property is, you know, if you're going to go to the lake, you're going to want to kind of relax and put all your worries aside. So make sure that you stay within your budget. The we, we definitely don't want people to be worrying about their finances when they're out at the lake. And the other thing to keep in mind, kind of along those same lines is once you get that lake place, there's going to be some accessories you're going to want to buy, you know, dock, boat, lift, jet ski, all that fun stuff. So make sure you kind of budget for those items as well. So what's the difference between purchasing like a regular, you know, home in town versus a lake property? Um, it can be very, very similar or very, very different. So if you're going to purchase a place that's already very suitable for year round use, um, it's going to be very similar to purchasing uh, a property like you would in town here. Um, so the big thing is, if it's a year round property and you're and it's going to be your primary place, it's going to be exactly the same. The lender might ask for a few extra things like, um, you know, a water test or well certification, but it's going to be really super simple. Same interest rates, um, no issues uh, where there are issues is if it's a seasonal property, um, lenders are going to want a little higher percentage of a down payment. Um, they might have a higher interest rate. So those are things to consider. Realistically, a lot of people, if they have a lot of equity in their current house, they might even refinance their current house and use that cash to buy a seasonal place. That way they still get that nice low interest rate and, and stuff like that, if that makes sense. But uh, honestly, I work with some great lenders here in Fargo, out in the lakes area. Um, they know what they're doing. We'll make sure to get you taken care of. Good stuff there. Other than financing, anything else we should be focused on thinking about? Um, the big thing is just to make sure you really think about how you're going to want to use a property. So between Becker and Ottertail County, there's almost 2000 lakes just in those two counties. So there is a lake that fits everyone. Um, one thing that people talk about is fish. So kind of the most sought after fish in our area is walleye. Most of the lakes in our area have walleyes, but not all of them do. Um, so make sure if, if that's something you're going after that that you're choosing a lake that has a good walleye population. Um, the other thing is muskie. People get really excited about muskie. There's only a handful of lakes that actually have muskie in our area. So there's a lot of good information that can be received from the DNR website in regards to fish and stocking reports and, and sizes and stuff like that. Um, the other things people always think about is restaurants or, or the area, you know, what you're going to do out there when you're not on the lake, you know, how close are you to, to a golf course? Can I boat up to a restaurant? Uh, things like that you want to consider. Good stuff there, my friend. Brian, I got about 30 seconds left. How can people get a hold of you? Uh, the easiest way is by text 218-850-2004. That's my direct line as well. Um, the slide you're checking out is a new listing we have on Cormorant as well on Seclusion Point Road. That's a pretty pristine luxury property. If anyone has interest in that, uh, make sure to give me a call, shoot me a text. Uh, Seclusion Point, it is kind of the best property on, on Cormorant in my opinion. Um, and this is a gorgeous house. So this is one you don't want to miss out on. Man, give him a call and go check that spot out. That looks fantastic. So Brian, thanks so much for joining us this morning. We appreciate it. We'll talk to you soon. All right. Thanks for having me. You bet. All right. Stay with us. We got much more coming up right after this.